I'm gonna, if there's ever gonna be a haunted house on one of my vlogs, one of these house cleanings that, that I do, the house cleanouts that I do, it's gonna be this house. Check that thing out. Dallas, Texas. I got Rob, the homeowner. Rob, how were we, man? How did we do today? Five stars. Five, five, five out of five. See this? See this guy? I didn't even ask him, but he gave me five stars. I didn't even ask him, and he still gave me five stars. And um, we were pretty good on time. I mean, we did it on time, right? Time was, yeah. It showed up on time. There you go. Would you recommend us again? I would do that. Yeah. Thumbs up, Rob? Thumbs up. Look at that. That's what I'm talking about. What's up guys, it's Ricardo, DFW Junk Guys, Junk Removal Service. Monday, it's raining. So the weather out here has been horrible. It's just horrible, horrible, horrible. Uh, the last few days, uh, it's been over 100 degrees. Uh, I'm talking about like 104, 102, 100, and, and, and it's been horrible. So today, the weather is 79 degrees today. It's beautiful. There's Diego without his t-shirt. Uh, why, what happened to his t-shirt? I'll explain it to you. Diego, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. The people want to know uh, what happened to your t-shirt, why, why you're not wearing it today. Because what happened, you know, I mean, we're wondering. Oh, it was wet, so I put it in the yard. Yeah. I put this because it was a little Yeah. Right. And you got here at what time? How long have you been here? 40 minutes. 40 minutes? Yeah. Okay. Thanks, man. Get back to work. <laughs> Don't know exactly what he said. Something about tooth or something i have no idea anyway guys we're gonna load up right here it is raining but i have a waterproof uh gopro so that's what we're gonna do um so a job like this here we are at a storage unit of course here we go how do we get deals like this okay so this storage unit peep person right here uh we actually have done work for him in the past okay so we've actually been here on other occasions i haven't been here in about a year but i've actually worked in this storage unit about three or four times in the last few years. Uh, this is Life Storage in Bedford, Texas. And Life Storage, whenever they get somebody that doesn't pay, they call us to get rid of the shit. And this person literally had a lot of crap. There's nothing really good in it. Uh, Y'all can tell inside, guys. I'm gonna walk into the, the dumpster, I mean the trailer. Not a lot of goodies at all. Can you believe someone pays to have this shit in here? Someone actually pays money to have junk in a storage unit. So this person was paying $190 a month and decided not to, to stop paying. And they went behind about two or three months. The owner actually uh, of the storage unit, he passed away. So the owner of the storage unit passed away and we're here to clean it up. So every time something like that happens, they usually call us people that don't pay. They call us uh, people who get evicted, they call us. So we're here again. 
me and Diego, Diego without his t-shirt. So what we're gonna do is probably run a time lapse, but I do wanna explain something really quick, is how we get these deals uh, on these evictions uh, for the storage units. It's very simple, guys. Usually what happens, um, and this is like the dumpster enclosures that I'm always doing. How did I get this deal here for this commercial job? Well, here it is. Uh, I did this facility here, uh, Life Storage in Bedford, about four years ago. When I was here, I had done, it was a, a family, and all they were doing is throwing away trash. They were moving to another city. So I came here in my truck by myself, and I did a job. And on the way out, I dropped my cart off out here. So I was already out here. I did not go and go beg somebody for a job so you know that that's the thing about it and i want to explain to to y'all guys that i do not uh, market to these people uh usually it just happens on a whim that I'm out here already, so I might as well drop off a card and let them you know, call me whenever something happens. And that's exactly what happened here. Um, I had done, was doing a job for a family four years ago. I dropped off a card at the front desk. I said, here's my card at the front desk. I just helped out somebody, one of your uh, tenants here, uh, renters, I guess you call it. And if you need something else done, and, and it wasn't about a week later, if I remember, they called me and they said, hey man, uh, we got someone that's not paying can you come and clean out and i of course i said yeah no nope. so that's how we get here guys about four years later i'm still working for the person and it's really easy i'm gonna tell you why they keep on calling me because i answer the phones and then i show up really easy it's not that hard all right guys so let's watch the time lapse and you know what i want to try something different i saw this on a youtube video where the guy turns around and then it's a time lapse All right, guys, so here's what we're doing. We just finished up uh, the junk removal. The owner got here, and I'm gonna charge him 250 for this removal, and let's see his reaction, okay? You need, you need to get rid of these tires too, right? Yeah. We'll manage to do it for you, sir. It's up to you. They will uh, they do charge for this. Oh, yeah? Yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. Come on. Yeah, they want. And that, 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 put, that right there, we're gonna throw that away. Okay. Earth Angels is a special edition by Gerald Patterson. It's a limited edition, so we don't throw it away. What we do, we toss it. There's no difference between them throwing and tossing away. That's a joke, man. Okay. God, you see that? <laughs> it's a straight face. You, see, you gotta admit, man, I, I kept a straight face, okay? Yeah. I was yeah, like, okay, why, why is it so special? I was like, okay. It's you never said nothing. <laughs> All she was doing is staring at me the whole time, and she's like, what can I do? Well, it's half a trailer, so it's 250 and that's it. We didn't stack it, we just tossed everything in there. You want to take a picture of the trash? Maybe it'll last longer or something? <laughs> <laughs> You're funny. <laughs> I would have charged you more if it was 100 degrees. Remove a couch and a mattress. Seems like that's what it's gonna be. And that's gonna do it for us, man. Really. So let's go down. Uh, let's go downtown and start working and uh, make some more money. It's a horrible, horrible day outside. So I've dropped a 12-yard dumpster this morning. That's why Diego's in the 550 with the trailer because I did another job. We didn't want to be out here all day. <laughs> 